Whoa! Everybody, welcome to Sunday. Well, today's a new day. But you know, Sunday's pay per view WCW Clash of Champions, baby. Where the champions put their titles on the line and go up against challengers. Great number one contenders. I want to welcome you to a good episode that's going to be. I want to try to get you something to drink. Get you some snacks. You see how right in here? I got me some freshly squeezed orange juice. You got me some snacky wackies. And I'm about to sit here and call these match cards of these champions. Mm, that is some good. Orange. Oh, I said orange juice. <laughs> I meant apple juice. It's your boy, the Red Lantern leader in the house, JJ Stewart. And let's get this match card going. We have champion match going through the whole night. Except for actually, this first match actually is not a championship match. It's a no holds bar match between Andre the Giant. Versus the Super Saiyan legend of all time, all time, all time, Broly. Let's get this card on the match. And that's weird that it's, I ain't gonna lie. It's weird that they're letting this match go through. Well... It's called Clash of the Champions, so I would think it's Clash of I would think Clash Clash of the Champions is the same thing as Night of Champions, where they got the concept. I know they got the concept of Night of Champions from Clash of Champions, basically, where every belt is on the line. But it's weird that this match is not a championship match, but every other match. Because I looked at the match card and I was going to switch some of the matches. And I looked, and I'm like, okay, wait a minute. Broly and Andre, but you never know. Just may, just actually may. I don't know. I, I, I you know what I didn't look. This may actually lead into a. Uh, no, this could be a number one contender match. This is what I'm saying. That I'm, I'm pissed that WWE don't do that, that, uh, that stuff no more. Where it lets you know if it's a number one contender match. Cause this could be a number one contender match. And I didn't even check to see if it was. Andre the Giant. Making his way to the ring from Grenoble, France, weighing in at 520 pounds, the eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant. Alright. <laughs> I like that way. Go! 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 The Super Saiyan legend himself. Broly. Now you see ladies and gentlemen, this Broly he doesn't got the color that hinges him, his power. So, imagine having a, a being like him and his that's not controlled. From out of this world, weighing in at 319 pounds, Brody! Brody! Two big, powerful beings. Hopefully they don't break the ring. But I kind of do want them to break the ring. Because you don't get that with big guys. They won't, like, literally... They won't, uh... Break the ring unless, like, you give them, like, multiple finishers or something like that. Or... If they kick it on the finishers. Then that's what they usually go for it. Burley with the bicycle kick. Andre with the slam. Andre with a straight shot to his back. 
Oh, Broly reverses it. Andre shoves Broly off. Ball for a strike. Ball for a suplex. That goes for a cover. This is gonna be three. Okay, okay, so it's a one count. Ooh, Andre with a knee strike. Then a shoulder tackle. Oh, Andre picking him up in the air! Buster old Andre. We gonna go for the cover? Oh no. Nope. Probably with that straight shot. Oh. Ooh, backbreaker into a Russian last week. Oh, is this a ice grip? Oh damn! He just slammed Broly. I mean Andre down. Go for the cover. That's a Kicks out on a one count two. I'm guessing that probably was his finisher. Oh wait, nope. Maybe that was his signature. Broly with the choke! Oh! Andre reversed it! Broly was trying to go for a toast slam. Finisher. Oh, nope. He's going for a combo. Oh, Andre. He's like, let's go. Bye, Buster. Uh oh, go for the. No, slam. The vice grip choke slam. Going for the toe slam again. We'll call this the Saiyan Slam. He going for it. The Saiyan Slam. He's gonna get it. One, two. Oh, that was close. That was close. Andre with the reversal. Broly with the reverse. Oh, bro, he throws him out the race. I'm guessing uh, they either was his finisher or his signature, but. Why did it reverse? Oh, bro, bro, he was trying to go for something. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing that was his furniture. His furniture is it? So where well, actually I just go to here. And see. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. So his furniture is the choke slam, and his signature is oh, it's a claw slam. That's what it is. Okay. Oh, Rolly with a knee shot. Hey, he's just perfect. I know Murphy. Murphy shows him off. Andre, you hit him with a back marker.
Rolling with a uh, bicycle kit. Probably this is no hole with bar. So that ain't gonna be no count out. Rolly with the Thayer Slam! You gonna go for the cover? You know. So this gonna be three. One! Two! Oh my god! Andre kicks out of it again! For the Thayer Slam. Andre with the reverse foul. Is this gonna be three? One! Two, three, what the hell? Andre just hits him with a knee, or not a knee, but an elbow drop, and that takes him out. But Broly hit him with two Saiyan choke slams. Yeah, that's a big win for him. What's this? Whoa, 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 whoa. What is Andre doing? What are you doing, Andre? Oh my gosh, he's just hitting Broly. Oh my gosh. Wow. I didn't see that coming. I, I, I did not see that coming. Well, I guess Broly got a new attitude. He ain't playing no games. He trying to send a message to the champion. Whatever belt he going for. He's either sending a he's sending a message to everyone and the champions. Like this champion right here. He may be sending a message to this champion. The w no, I said that was the same the WCW. Uh, the DC Showcase champion, Warhorse. He could be potentially trying to go after him. Or he could be potentially trying to go after the other champion. But he don't notice. But he didn't injure him. But he did damage him. He's probably going to be out for a couple weeks. You know Broly gonna get stronger and he gonna come back for revenge on oh, Andre. I, 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 I'm shocked to say but I like this new attitude of Andre the Giant. You could say <laughs> he could come join the Red Lantern Court but we already got a big guy. We got our big guy Atrocitus. Maybe our boy against Andre, but you know, I'm gonna let Andre do his thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep good close eye on him. Well let's get this match on the way. We got the champ putting his title on his title up on the line against Walter from Arpidium. We are Arpidium. Wonderful. I'm not gonna lie. I wish when they um the showcase classic championship. Oh yeah, I forgot the title matches. They don't uh, say your name until you get in the ring. Whoa! We are a pity of yeah, we do what we want. Hopefully they, I'm about to say, uh, hopefully they make, uh, and better, and 2K22, 
where you can have the CPUs actually, the AIs, well, you still say the same the CPUs actually pick up weapons and stuff, like where there's no hole with bars and all that kind of stuff, and they actually go out the ring and go grab the weapon. Because it's like, when you don't, they, they won't go out there and get it. They just stay in the ring just fighting you, basically. Unless you pick up a weapon. So. Walter from Arpidium. Introducing the champion from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 193 pounds. He is the Action Classic Champion, War Haas. War Haas. That's gonna be one. Of, that's gonna be my belt. I'm gonna capture that belt one day. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Warhorse defending his belt, the DC champion, the DC Showcase Championship belt against Opinions on Walter. Walter going out the match already with a slam on Warhorse. Then just kicked it right in the back. Walter playing no games. Warhorse with the reversal. Getting with that big elbow straight. Warhorse like he played no games too. Oh, a headbutt on Walter. Oh, and he goes for the cover. You think he's going to get this quickly? You got to do more damage than that, Warhorse. Ooh, Warhorse with the hip toss. Walter with the uppercut. What is this going on? Water with us? Ooh. Oh, well, actually, no, it wasn't a super. Inverted super. Warhorse with the Hurricanrana. He got, ooh. Oh, 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 okay, Warhorse, what the stumps? Oh, twisting that neck. Was it with a big boot? Strike on Warhorse's face. Warhorse with the reversal. Warhorse with the drop kick. They didn't take Walter down. Oh, we got him in the corner. Oh, Dr. Rev over. Flash in the corner by Warhorse. He goes for the cover, but the ref is down. That's what they need to add to the game. That when a ref is taken out, another ref should be able to come in. Automatically. One. Oh, nope. Takes out the workout. Could that would have been a three? Would that would have been a three if the ref was still up? I don't know. Oh, wow. What they call him into a neck, uh, a backbreaker. Warhorse reverse. Warhorse with a jump kick again. But Walter's still up standing. Ooh, a German suplex from Walter. Warhorse. Oh, Warhorse with a reversal. Walter with a reversal. What's this? Oh, Walter back with a reversal. Put him on the rope. What is he going for? So we have a Warhorse going flying. Warhorse! 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 War horse! War horse! War going fire! This is awesome. 
This is awesome. This is awesome. We're going to top up and get the... Or is looking with the Versa. The Jawbreaker. Oh! Close rod! Takes Walter off his feet. Oh, and Walter in the corner. What is he going for? Oh, Walter with the Reverso. Walter saw Warhurst in the corner and he goes for a close line. Walter. Get thrown in the corner. Oh, Walter with the Reverso. Warhurst with the Reverso. Oh, chop, chop, chop. Ooh. Warhurst with the chops on Walter. Walter rolls off the ring. He got to catch his breath. This is getting impact right here. We get reversals after reversal. Oh, Walter with the chop. Then he goes for a kick. Warhurst reverses it. Warhurst with a backhand. Now he goes for a kick. Walter reverses it. Walter with the chop. Warhurst with the chop. Warhurst goes back in the ring. Warhurst gets in with a DDT. Warhurst is going to the top rope. What is he going for? A double stump on Walter. There's no cover. Can he get to the cover? He does. Is it going to be a three? One. Two. Ooh. That was close. Oh, whoa. Walter going for that. Head smash. A Walter. War throws into the corner. And head smashing him on the apron. Or that ring post. Or not the ring post. The apron buckle. That's what I'm going to say. He goes for the cover. One. Two. I'm about to say, you ain't going to take. Walter all like that, uh uh. You know if you if you know Walter about Walter, you know you ain't taking him off with no head shots like that. Walter at the top again, is he going for a double knee strike again? Oh no, he's going for something different. He goes for a drop kick. It takes Walter on his feet. Off his feet. Walter just got splashed out the ring by Warhorse. He did a cross body over the top rope with him. This is what happened. When you try to retain your belt, you do anything as possible. Walter with the reversal. Or the guy on his knees and started smacking his face in. Powder hat face in. Warhorse had to take a break. Throw it out the ring. Walter following him out there. Walter tried to go for a strike. Warhurst reversed it. Warhurst. <laughs> he went for a strike. In the corner. On Walter. He's going for a double knee strike. He's going for an elbow drop, but he missed it. Warhurst War missed the elbow strike. Walter is about to capitalize on it. What is he going for? He's going for a, a Boston Crab. Is Warhurst going to tap out? He's right there, literally right there to the rope. Is he going to grab the rope? Oh, no. He reverses it. He gets out of it. Oh. Walter tried to go for the Boston Crab again. But Warhurst reverses it. Warhurst needs him right in the back. Put him straight into a submission. Is Walter going to submit? Oh, no. He reverses. He breaks out of it. Oh. 
Pop handle. Slam. And it's going to be three. Oh, no. Roll break. If he wasn't on a roll break, could that would have been would that would have been a three? No. More of getting hyped up for it. Warhurst with that pump hammer slam again! Or this might be a rule break again! Warhurst, come on now! Didn't you learn your lesson from it? Uh-oh. Is this a tombstone? Oh, a tombstone! Oh, Warhurst, is he gonna cover it? Oh, no. Warhurst wants to reverse with the jawbreaker. Oh! He could have covered him right there. He busts Walter open. He's bleeding. He's going for a drop kick again. Can he get it on Walter? Oh wait! A Hurricanrana! Is this gonna be three? Two! Oh my gosh it is! That Hurricanrana pin got him to win! I give it to him. I give it to Warhorse. I'm not gonna lie. Even though Walter lost, this is a win for both of them. Cause this was an epic match. You had chops on chops, strikes after strikes. Yeah, I mean, I actually give it to both of them. Even though Walter lost, they both got the win in this match. Because it was epic. Strikes from strikes. Suplex to suplex. Kicks to kicks. Punches to punches. Chops to chops. Reversal after reversal. Yeah. I can't wait to see who is, who is next. Uh, I kind of want to see this match again. Further down the line. I want to see them go out of the year. Because that was, that, was that was a good ass. That was an, actually not a good ass match. That was a great match. An epic match. Actually an epic match. Epic match actually. Alright we got the. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all. WWE is doing so bad that uh, they was losing budget. So the women's of NXT in your house, they had to leave there and they had to go down there to BCW. I know they had to go to BCW. They working at BCW right now, so they get more money on the indies and all that. So they gotta they gotta do this. They gotta go to BCW. Not it's not for long time. Just for like a until they get more money to go back to NXT in your house, basically. So we have a, the BCW Women's Tag Team Champions, the Blueprint, Sasha Banks, and Ding Dong. Hello. It's Bailey, the role models, as your tag team champions facing off, defending well, well, still facing off, facing off against Hype Girl, accompanied by Hyper Speed, and Jade Young. I think it's Jade Young. Who you think gonna win? Put it in the comments below. You think Jade and Hype Girl gonna win? Or do you think the role models are going to retain their titles? Well, we're going to find out. Oh, I don't know if I...
If I gave them a finisher, I don't think I'd do it. Hey, 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 look at that. I like this entry. Hey. The BCW Tag Team, the BCW Women's Tag Team Champions. The role models. Hey, 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 what's cooking? Bailey, what you cooking? <laughs> They're like, you don't want that smoke? You don't want that smoke? Who want the smoke? Who want the smoke? <laughs> Who want the smoke, bruh? See, man, I can't wait to when they actually put music in here, or they won't, when it won't be copyrighted, then you can enjoy the video actually even more better, or actually listening to the music. Hey.
Billy with the Kozo HG. Jay tags in. HD. Go for that elbow strike on Bayless. Oh, this is a submission. Hold on. Oh, what is this go? Oh, what the hell? They go for a triple power bomb. Uh, I didn't even know you could do that with a guy with the females. But triple power bomb on Sasha Banks. Wow. I mean, I'm not going to hit no rematch. They uh, got to work their way back up there. They knew what they was doing, doing that. It seems like all the champions are retaining their titles, basically, so far. The role models retain theirs. War has retained his. Can sell an Alucard company by London Alucard. Hopefully, she don't got the triple power, bro. Well, if she do it, she will, she will, well, Tony will win, but she will still retain her title. Sella Alucard. 
husband of London Alucard got them company her rings I went Paul Heyman she defended her BCW Women's X Division Championship belt. Can she retain it or is Tony Storm going to get that tornado win? Let's get it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And it's for the ECW Extreme Television Championship. Oh, they matching in purple too, I believe. Oh, yeah, they are. Introducing the challenger from Melbourne, Australia, Tony Storm. Introducing the champion from Cleveland, Ohio, she is the ECW Extreme Television Champion, the Queen Clemens. All right, let's get it.
Sutherland with a knee strike on Tony. Sutherland with a jawbreaker. Oh! Oh, Tony's like, nah, uh, uh. Tony with a hurricane on Sutherland. Not today, Mikey. Well, I got her on the road. Tony with the kicks. Oh well, Sutherland reversed it. Ooh, threw her on her face. So with the Bailey to Bailey. Two on two. Oh boy. Sulla went for the pump handle slam. Two, three. Oh, wow. It seems like all the champions are retaining their title. I keep taking these managers off, but I keep putting them on. I don't know why. I gotta go through there again. And take it off. Our next match up. Oh, damn, that went quick and fast. Is we got the Multiverse Tag Team Champions, Big Show and Kane. Going out to whole different multiverses facing people from monsters, from actual men, to creatures, to villains, to superheroes. Right now they're facing off. Their first defense are against humans of the WWE. Killian Dane and Big E.
Let's see if they're going to retain a multiverse tag team champion. Oh! We ain't even getting no music. That's it. Forget that. That's it. Let's go. Oh, what is this? The authors of pain. Whoa! Uh. Uh. uh <coughs> I'm speechless. Uh. So the authors of pain. Just took Big E and Killian Day's spot for the tag team title. So what's the authors of pain? Against Big Show and Kane. Uh, I don't even know what to say to that. Let's get it! Hit that bell, ref! Ooh! They clash together. Oh, Big Show on him like that! Okay, Big Show. Whoa! We got you, Big Show. Big Show, pick it. I don't even know which one this is. How do you tell the difference between the two again? Oh, I got the one with the big tattoo and the other one with the other tattoo. Uh, uh I think this is... Okay, so... Okay, this is Akum. Akum got the tattoo at the top. Razor has a tattoo at the bottom. Okay. So I remember. Okay. Aiken with a reverse on Big Show. He's going to take again Razor. Oh, Razor tried to clash with Big Show. Oh, Big Show chopped the hell out of Razor like that. He like, what you thinking, boy? Big Show tags in King. He's like, you want a piece of this? Come get some of this. Razor with the reversal cane. Or the shoulder tackle. Pain with the kicks and slams. I didn't see Drake Maverick right there. Oh, <laughs> uh, this is Razor. Razor just reverse came. Razor Texan, Ty Liz, Akum.
Who failed the reversal? Here come those who in the corner trying to tag the razor, but he reverses it. They can tag the razor. Power bomb. Oh, they can't go for the high tag. Oh. Raise our power bomb. Came with the reversal. Make sure what these clothes are. You already know what the time is, but you need to go through. Razor, Aiken, with the knee strike. Whoa! One, two. Oh, yeah. Bishop tried to throw him in the corner, but it didn't work. Thank you. 
take him with the clothes while the big show. Big show tosses him down. Oh, Big Show tried to go for the KO. I can reverse it. Are you going for that finisher? Ooh. Is it going to be three? Is Kane going to get in there? One. Two. And Big Show kicks out of it. He didn't need Kane. Oh. And Razor going for the finisher. Is Big Show going to reverse it? And he does. He can go for the KO punch. Body slam. Could have been looking to go for that double choke slam. Oh, make sure what that is. Make sure the top of the corner. Acom takes in a Can Big Show get the tag? He does. Okay, coming in. Close line in the hell. Oh, and him with a big boot. Oh, big. I mean, I mean, came with a drop kick. Out of nowhere. Oh, but he got a drop. By Razor. Kane like, uh uh. Kane going for that choo -hoo! Ooh. Look, can he pay that without Razor dump? I mean, ain't gonna get in. It's gonna be three. Ooh. It was almost three. Oh, what's this Kane doing? Oh, Kane tossing on the rope. Ain't him on the rope. And go for the cover again. Got them in the Irish whipping them into the turn muscle. Oh, we got a hot tag to Aikum. Aikum with a big boot. Oh, Kane picks him up. And it slams him down. Hey, okay, no game. Punch him straight in the face. Oh. Punch him on the rope. Tag him, Big Show. Make sure goes for the cover. It's going to be three. One. Two. Oh, no, it's just out. Make sure just hit him with the KO punch. Can he get him with the tough bear? This is going to be three. Get it, Kane, get it. What? Oh, Kane missed it. Echo with the reversal. Echo with the clothesline. Echo goes to the top rope. Echo with the spit splash, but Bishop puts his knees up and catches him. Uh oh. 
Knee strikes on the big show from Echo. Oh, there you go. Got him in the camel clutch. He's going to tap out. Is Razor going to tap out? And he don't. Oh, Brickson going for the KO punch. Is he going to get it? Woo! <laughs> Brickson stopped him from a good number. <laughs> he can't get in here. You just not making it in time, man. Big show with the suplex on Akum. Oh, man, you take the partner up. Go for the cover again. Oh. Where's over the straight strike to Big Show face? I was about to say, you better off just tagging Kane in, Big Show. Let him do it, and then you go. Because this is like two opportunities that they could have retained their title, but Kane keeps missing it. Big Show in the verse power mode. Not on my work. I think it was. Hmm. Oh, he tried to go for a Boston crab, but broke break. Final cut. Ooh, very right with the close out on Big Show.
Hey, with the sidewalk slam on Akum. Tigers in Big Show? Nope. Time to go for a submission on Akum and just missed. Kango submit to Razor. Oh, he was telling him that. I don't know if Kango reversed it. He tried to go for the sidewalk slam. Uh-oh. 
Is K gonna kick out? Is Big Show gonna get it or nothing? Time one, two, get in, Big Show! Damn! If they would have got her, if Big Show would have got her in enough of Nick and Tom, he would have had that. So we got one belt changed. So your new, the new, a multiverse tag team champion. The authors of pain. Wow. That's something right here. All right. All right, we have. I believe this is the. BCW Women's Champion. I believe this is the BCW Women's Champion. Captain Marvel defending her title against the Empress of Tomorrow, Asuka versus the Queen of Flares, Charlotte. A triple threat, so they can use weapons, but I doubt that they use weapons. All right, let's get it going. Introducing the challenger from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair. Oh, I forgot he like Fatal Four Ways. I forgot Fatal Four Ways, uh, Triple Threats, Six Men. They don't wait till all the, the participates in the ring. I forgot that they don't do that. Oh yeah, BCW. I gotta put it, I gotta put it on there to say BCW is one of the She is the women's champion, the Captain Marvelous. <laughs> All right, so I said, now we're talking. I guess they're big fans of Captain Marvel. He liked to see that. He liked to see Captain Marvel. <laughs> that was funny. My man says, and now we're talking. And introducing the challenger from Osaka, Japan. For the BCW Women's Championship. Let's get it. <laughs> Captain Marvel, like, oh, I'm just gonna watch her do this. I don't know about. 
Oh, okay. Austin trying to hit a drop kick on the uh, cap. Cap hit a reverse. I mean, cap hit a drop kick on on Charlotte. She up in the front drop kick. Charlie got her in a submission. Oh my god, I forgot where I was at. Charlie closed off Oscar back outside the ring. Charlie with a knee strike on Cap. Charlie with the cover. Oh, too cold. Cap with the reversal. Russian leg sweep. Oscar. Oscar here with her finisher. And she gonna go for the cover. Oh no. Pin Charlotte. What? Oh, that would have been something if she got that. That she hit her finisher on Cap, then hit a move on Charlotte. Up, oh, Charlotte hit with a reversal. Cap starting to move around. Charlotte hit her with a. Oh, Charlotte hit her going for her national selection. You gonna go for the cover? No. Cap just waiting for it to come around. Oh, Cap. Didn't pay attention to Charlotte, apparently. Did it with a flapjack. 
Cat rolls off the ring. Charlotte goes for the cover on Oscar. It's gonna be three, one, two. Oh no! <laughs> Charlotte started to strut her stuff. Oh, Oscar without her Corona. She goes for the cover. Cap gets up. Cap gets in the ring. One. The ref is down. The ref is down. I repeat, the ref is down. The ref always get knocked out. Ooh, a Superman punch. He goes for the cover. But that's not going to do that because the ref is down. What's this cat going for? Going up to the top rope. What's she about to do? She about to hit a move on Oscar. She about to hit a back. Oh, she tried to hit a back moonsaw. But Oscar picks her up. Here with a clothesline. Here with another clothesline. Swings her out. Kicks her in the face. She goes right after Charlotte. Knees are in the back. One, two, two. Oh, knee strike, drop kick. Charlotte hits a knee strike on Cap. And Asuka kicks Charlotte.
Cap with a neck breaker on Asta. Call it a and Cap going at it. Cap, Cap reverses. Oh! Charlie reverses ahead with a DET. Charlie hits the goes for the cover. One! Uh one count. Oh, two count. Knock the ref out again. Cap goes for the cover, but the ref is knocked out. <laughs> I guess she don't realize that. Cap goes for the top rope. Trying to go for that move, so probably. Oh, nope. She goes for a uh, 630. Did it land on, on Charlotte? I'm guessing not. Because Oscar, Oscar hit her with her finisher. Oh. Now Cap and Oscar going at it. Cap hit her with a strike. Oh! Uh oh! Cap about to go for a drop kick on Oscar's face! Kicks her right in her face. She gonna go for the cover? She does. It's gonna be a three. One! Two! Oh! Nope. Oh yeah, two count. Oh, Charlie gets back up on her feet. Top daughter. One, two, ooh. <clears throat> Put it in the submission and Charlotte on top. Oscar getting up, is she gonna break it? Oh nope. Charlotte reverses it. Cap with the some not submission, the roll up. Oscar broke it up. Charlie top the cap spears her! Oh, knee strike on Oscar from Charlotte. And Charlotte goes for the color on Cap. It's going to be through one, two, no. Woohoo. Oh, Charlotte hit her with natural selection. Natural selection. Is Oscar going to be able to get up in time enough to break up the cover? Is she? It's going to be three, one, two. Three! We got a new BCW Women's Champion, the Queen, Charlotte. So now we got two new champions. <laughs> Just when we start retaining belts, now people start to become champions.
All right, in our main, ev main event, our main event, ladies and gentlemen, is two brothers going up against each other. Maddox defending his DC championship belt or DC Comics championship belt against his brother Jester. Let's see who's gonna win. I kind of want to see. I kind of do want to see them go up against each other like it's doing now. And then I want to see them team up with each other. But then I kind of see, I, I kind of want to see both of them go for, well, one of them keeps, one of them have the DC championship belt and another one has the, uh, The showcase belt. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Action Championship. Someone said, damn. He like, this is some real, real stuff going on. Introducing the challenger from your darkest fears. Weighing in at 310 pounds, the Jester. Introducing the champion from every man's nightmare, weighing in at 276 pounds, he is the action champion, Mania.
Ooh. Oh, oh. Punch after punch on, on Jester. I'll put him in a, sub a submission. Is Jester going to tap? Maddie going for up. Oh, Jester reverses it. Oh, Maddie goes for. Oh, what the hell? That? I don't even know. It went into a pin combo. He goes for the top rope. What is he going for? Well, oh, oh, goes for a fall splash, but he didn't even make it. Half of it connected. Puts him in the arm lock. Ooh. Goes for us. Suplex into a neck breaker. Uh-oh. Going for a hip toss. And nope. Just reverses it. Versus that too. Oh! That's just threw him up in the air, made him hit him, made him hit the concrete, or concrete, but the map first, face first. Matt goes to the cover. Matt goes with the. Uh, I don't even know what it was a sunset flip, I'm, I'm guessing. Strike on just his face. That's with the reversal.
Let's show the top rope what he's going for. Uh, oh, Max reverses it. We got another submission as we go on top. With Manic on top. No, he doesn't reverse his look. We got another submission again. Like them all on the on the on the on the concrete. Oh, what's Jester going for? Oh, Justin with the knee strike on Manic. Oh, Jester with that three. Power bombs on Manic. Is he going to go for the cover? 
He does. One, two. Ooh. This is a good, great, wonderful, epic match, main event match. Ooh, it's choke slam. Is it gonna go for the cover? No. Just about to hit his signature. Ooh. He goes for the cover. One, two, three. Oh my gosh, ladies and gentlemen, we got a new champion. His brother, Jester, comes out with a job. I still don't know what the hell that was, that flip, sunset flip stuff. I gotta, oh, okay. Alright. We're gonna have this one more time. I usually don't do this. But... Ah, I don't know. I'm gonna do it, okay? I'm, 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 I'm gonna talk to, I'm gonna talk to Vince McMahon, and I'm gonna see if I can get this match to go again, because this match was hell. This was hell. Between these two, Jester and Maddox, the brothers going at each other. I want to see them go at each other again, and... I want to see, um, who else was it? It was another match. Let me see. I got to see. I want them to go at it again because usually I, I'm doing the same thing that WWE does where they don't give our rematch calls. I just go on to the next person. But if the match is that damn good, I want to see them go at it again. I believe it was Big Show. No, it was... Walter, Walter and Warhorse. Walter and Warhorse, and cause Warhorse retained his title. Yeah. So that and that's funny how at the beginning of it, everybody retained their titles, leading up to here, three people just lost their titles. I, right, I believe. Yes, uh, Captain Marvel lost her title. Maddox lost his title, and Big Show and Kane lost their title. It was like, what the hell? Okay, yeah, I'm going to talk to Vince McMahon, and I'm going to see at the next pay-per-view. At the next pay-per-view, which is, uh, let me see what the next pay-per-view is, actually. Let's see. Ooh, we got two pay-per-views. We got, well, that NXT going to be BCW. It's going to be a BCW pay-per-view. So I'm trying to think, should I have, I'm, I'm going to think about it. I'm going to have this be... BCW gonna be like NXT basically. Only exclusive to them only. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay. So I'm gonna have wait, can you do can you do one show? Just one show by itself? On her view? Oh you can. Okay, I didn't know that. Wait, they're just gonna change this up. Oh, so it's not gonna let me have both on both shows. Oh, it won't let me. But what maybe I think what I have to do is probably do this one first and then do that one. I'm I'm gonna check and see. So all right, so at the next pay per view is gonna be BCW. That's the one I'm not worried about. I think the right okay, so it's the Royal Rumble. Um. 
I'm going to have... Yeah, okay, at the Royal Rumble, I'm going to have... I'm going to ask Vince McMahon... I'm going to ask him if we can have Warhorse versus Walter again, but it's going to be in a different kind of match this time. Because it was, I think it was, no, it was a regular match. Yeah. I'm going to have them face off again for the title belt one more time. And then I'm going to have, I'm going to have Manic faces his brother Jester for Jester's title for the belt. In a different kind of match too. And then once that's settled. I'm going to make Jester and Manic. A tag team. Because I want to see them as a tag team. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, yeah. So. Oh we in March now. Right? Or no. January. Alright. That's the next show. Yeah. Oh, okay. So we in January now. Uh, Wednesday. Yep. Next paper. I mean, not next paper. Okay. Yeah. So next show. Ooh, wait. Did I skip a lot of stuff? Or hope I did. Oh, it's no. What the hell is getting me? Oh, damn. Ah. Uh, okay, so that's not what I wanted. It skipped me to elimination chamber. Skip past. Oh, uh, I, I, but I clicked damn January. I should just hit next time. I'm just gonna hit next show. Okay, so the champions are still the same. They didn't switch. None of them didn't change. Okay. So that's good. Well, that screwed my plans up. Um. I'll start that rivalry. I don't want that one. Um. Actually, I'll let these go. Because I think, uh, because at BCW, we, we will have a title match. Oh, wait, it'll be Stella putting her title up against my girl, part of the Red Lantern Corps, Kara, aka Super K. Okay, so for this one, what the Rivals got, Manic. No, I don't want you going up against Papa Shango. I want this to could actually oh what you know what I'm actually gonna let that stay no I don't want that one. Why actually let them stay? You know what? Actually, Warhorse. No, because I don't want Warhorse feuding with him yet. So actually, I'll start this one. So that'll be okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So that's. So, yeah, okay, so that's what I'm going to have at, well, damn, that just screwed my whole plans. I was just about to do that. Damn game. All right, well, then I'm going to have an elimination chamber. I'm going to have that, then. I'm going to have, wait, can, can women be in the elimination chamber? I believe so. I think you can put them in there. If so, then I'm going to put. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, let me just end the stream. I mean, not stream in the video. And I'll tell y'all.
what we have in the elimination chamber on Wednesday for BCW. It's your boy JJ, aka the Red Lantern Leader, and I'll see y'all later, man. Peace. See y'all Wednesday. Make sure y'all get that power ring, that red latch power ring. Smack that like. Oh, actually, zap that like button. Zap the follow button. And support your boy. Become a red lantern leader. Uh, not a red lantern leader. A red lantern core member. Join me. All right, boys. Peace.